percent of what we do in Alexa 13 is identical to what we did in Alexa 12 in terms of the code. One difference is we're going to use a combo box instead of a list box. But in both cases we have a text box and a button. And when we click the text box, when we click the button, the contents of the text box is saved to a database table. And then the database table is used to refresh the list box, or in this case the combo box. So we named this combo box CBX Frequent Author. And then we get a label called Frequent Author in order to, to let the user know that's what it is. And the whole rationale between having a frequent author combo box is we want to be able to select authors we use over and over and have those written into the author text box. So he doesn't have to type in the value to the author text box. Say Dean Kuntz or Stephen King, I use those dozens of times. So having a frequent author combo box is a real time saver for me. And at the start of day, what we want to do is fill in this combo box with the values from the frequent author database table, AB frequent author. So once again, we have a call in our form uh, load event to fill FA list box, which is pretty much identical to the fill type list box that I had in Alexa 12. In fact, I just take the code from the fill types list box, copy it and paste it into the fill FA list box. And I create a command object called populate FA input and give it the select uh, SQL code of select author from AB frequent authors order by author. And then I create a SQL data reader by doing an execute reader on this command and once again loop through in a frequent authors read of the records that we've created and add those add the author field from those records to the combo box with a items dot add um, method and then of course we have to close the reader because we're going to use it over and over. So we, when we run this it works pretty well. There are the authors filled in the uh, list box. But one problem we notice with the, the list box is it's a uh, drop down style. In terms of the drop down style it's drop down. And what we really want is a drop down list. And the difference is a drop down list is read only. So there's no way the user can type something into the text box and then have it added to the list, which we don't want them to do. We do want them to add to the list, but not in that way. Because we want to add to the table and it won't it'll just add to the list, not the table. So now we need to add our text box with the name author so the user knows that that's where he types in the author. And we have an add to frequent authors button which is the technique by which he can add to the combo box indirectly by adding to the database table. We named the text box TXT author and we named the uh, button BTN add frequent author. And then we go into the click event for this button by double clicking on it. And here once again we just copy the code from the uh, Alexa 12 which uh, essentially reads the value in the text box into a string variable and then creates a command object and does a insert into frequent authors author field values and the concatenated uh, string local string variable which comes from the uh, txt text property so essentially we're writing the text box into the database and we actually do that by doing the execute non-query on the uh, command object. And then once again we call the fill FA list box.
to refresh the values in the combo box which now includes our new author we just added. But the new uh, wrinkle that we have for this is that we now want to be able to select an author from the frequent author and that happens in the select index change whenever you select a new author and we just take the value from the combo box text property and make it equal to the text box of the author property so let's run that portion and see if that works we go over and select an author from the combo box uh, DW Buffa and sure enough DW Buffa shows up He writes a lot of lawyer books and Mary Higgins Clark she gets written into the box and we go down to the bottom and select Oscar Wilde and he gets written in the box so everything's working El Perfecto. I hope you enjoyed the lesson and remember until uh, Alexa 14 to focus and learn a lot.